Welcome everybody, my name is Katrinka, I am a professional singer and a voice coach and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to continue with our mini YouTube series Voice Coach Reacts and let me tell you, we started this series with a bang. I want to say a huge thank you for all your love and support and all the kind comments that you left on my first Voice Coach Reacts video. It means so much to me and uh, Personally, there were a lot of tears and a lot of shock. It filled me with so much positivity and determination to work even harder on my future videos. I will be uploading every Monday and straight after the upload, I will head to a live stream. There will be a link to the live stream in the description of this video. I will be live streaming Voice Coach Reacts where you can come and chat with me, you can give me your opinions about the performance I just uploaded, or you can give me some further questions that you have about the performance, or you can even upload your own performances and I will react to them. So come and chat with me, don't be scared to interact with me, and I will try my hardest to answer all your questions. Today, we are gonna react to So Hyung, I really hope that I did not mispronounce this name because she's a wonderful lady. <laughs> per usual, I have a few short information about her. She is a South Korea singer and she debuted in 1996 with the song Mister. Where I instantly connected to So Hyang was when I found out the information about her being an author of a fiction. She actually written multiple fantasy novels and her most well known are Crystal Castle and Anaxian. So this is some seriously multi-talented lady, hands down. Okay, so let's start. Before I'm gonna say anything about the singing, um, I checked her short bio and uh, I'm amazed! <laughs> but she looks amazing, she's really beautiful. And so far, nice breath control, it is really angelic, but I really like that her voice is not so thin, it still has a fullness in it, even though it's very obvious that she is singing a very quiet part. You can see how well she articulates. I think I've heard the song before, but not by her. And the beauty in the word Arirang itself is in that nice, beautiful, well-pronounced R. And she is pronouncing every single word very well. She's opening her mouth, which is very first basic thing that a voice coach is gonna tell you to have relaxed your jaw and to open your mouth properly. The voice in the song starts here, but if you want it to be bigger and more substantial, you need to open your mouth properly so the sound can get to its final form. <laughs> I don't know why, but she has this extremely positive presence, like 
she is smiling her corners of her mouth are up that's one thing that my voice teacher used to tell me all the time smile it's gonna force you to open your mouth a little bit more while singing but at the same time you're gonna put out this positive presence it's very obvious that she's got a very good um very good um breath and voice control because she doesn't have to push that hard to keep the tone where it should be for some people it's just literally like weightlifting <laughs> so they have to push really hard to get there and you can see wings popping you can see the mortified face expression and you can see like the whole body clench which is a phrase that i introduced last video and it's whole body clench we don't want whole body clench we want relax we want not pushing too hard to get where you want to be This is a really nice addition. You could see that beautiful lift without any kind of interruption between her chest and uh, head voice. Really beautiful. And I think it was very much influenced also by the violin. It's a very nice little detail that some singers do and I really appreciate it. And it's really creative and really, really pretty when it's done very well. It usually happens if you have a short intermission with uh, an instrument, if it's a piano or guitar or in this case a violin that you sort of imitate the movement of the instrument with your own voice you have to do it well for it to be readable because music overall is a dialogue it can be a dialogue between um the singer and uh, the instrumentalist it can be a dialogue between a singer and another singer or singer and uh, their audience but it's always some kind of an interaction She even did the movements. All right, I'm going to stop it there. Very, very beautiful control, whole body control, but she still did not clench. She was still in her natural or chest voice. Beautiful. Again, there was a part where she was directly uh, working with uh, the violin. But this time it was like a whole stage was building the tension. beautiful run i really also like that um because the violin is so much incorporated into uh the whole performance she's not just using her voice to kind of compliment her but she is showing uh the whole audience the connection between them You can see that this time kind of roles change. Actually, in fact, uh, the violin kind of responded to her. Also, I have to say that her performance is so positive. How much Dimash was emotional and lyrical. Her performance is just soaked with positivity and just so much good energy.
nice switches between um, chest voice and a hat voice. Again, they're they're pretty quick and they're pretty far apart. So she's holding on very well in them. Everyone's singing. Oh. Beautiful. And she was actually holding it and then interrupted and hit it again. <laughs> That was so satisfying. You can almost like see it on their faces. Look at their faces. This is a face of shock and an utter satisfaction. <laughs> nice. Very nice. I, I'm very happy that this looked comfortable to her. It's already in a very high register, but she did not look like struggling whatsoever. So, I really, really, really enjoyed this performance. When I first saw her, I was expecting this high-pitched, bright, angelic voice. Honestly, yes, we got a um, really angelic performance. It was beautiful. She looked like floating. No full body clench. It was a voice of a woman. It was grown up. It was finished it was just very substantial it was really really beautiful i really loved the whole performance i loved how comfortable she was it was very obvious that she's not scared of that high registra i would probably mark her voice as a full lyric soprano but the singer was amazing but the whole performance was absolutely outstanding she had so much control over the stage so I'm super happy that I checked um, So Hyang and her wonderful performance. I will definitely go and check more of her work. And I will for sure go and check some of her fantasy novels. If you do enjoy my content and you would like to see more videos of my mini series Voice Coach Reacts, or you would like to see some more of my covers, Please don't forget to click the subscribe button and the notification bell button so you will always know when I'm gonna upload a new video. Don't forget, straight after uploading this video, I will go live. There's gonna be a link in the description of this video. So you can give me all your opinions, all your questions about the, the performance we just watched. So yeah, I cannot wait to chat with you. Thank you so much for watching again and please stay safe and healthy and I will see you next time.